Hi everybody, this is Liz with 143 Handmade and I'm here to show you this little journal today. Well, it's not so little, it's seven and a quarter wide. By ten and a quarter to ten and a half, depending on how much fluff you add. You measure. About two inches on the spine and about one inch at the mouth right now. But as you add things, obviously it will get th thicker. These are upcycled covers from a pirate book. And so, um, let's flip through here. I've got pages from a landscaping book, from a poetry book, coffee stain papers, map pages, um, coloring book pages, and every signature has an envelope page. This one's this direction. This is a piece of craft paper, and it will, the, the longer the book is closed, the more flat it will get. And let's see, more coffee stain paper. Well, this is really cool. This is out of a um, vintage or antique, I'm not sure which, but um, book of poetry. Um, it's one of those um, ideals. I don't know if anybody else remembers those, but this is one of those, out of one of those anyways. And it has these cool little poems on them, and it tells you, you know, who wrote it and the copyright and all that at the bottom of each one. This is just a really cool picture of a mountain. Some more coffee stained paper. Some just good bits of advice. The Complete Life's Little Instruction Book, just a page out of that, because I think those are fun. Another, uh, the other half of that envelope page. There's some pretty purple flowers. More map pages. A butterfly page. And I mean a butterfly page because of how it's installed, not because it has butterflies on it. And this is actually clouds, cloud formations. Excuse me, more coffee stained paper. Map page, I added a little sewn on tabby there. And then this is the final page. It has this rather large envelope here. You can put whatever you would like in there. Stick it away, hide it in the back here, and you got a little closure. And there's an additional pocket here on the side. And this is the lovely back cover. With these pirate ships and then it has my favorite part of this whole journal I think is the fact that this journal has a back pocket so it would be a great place to stick your pens you know and be able to just have them on the ready I think the reason why that that's so funny to me is that in high school my senior year especially I kept my pens in my back pocket because I could never find them if I put them in my backpack and so there we go um, it is um, a covered spine, so you can't see, you know, the stitching. So it is bound with hemp. So thank you so much for checking this out. And um, don't forget to like and subscribe. And um, the link below, there will be a link below to purchase this journal if you are interested. If it has been sold, that will be in the title. Thank you so much.